So tonight I watched Sandra Goldbacher's Me Without You. It's from 2001. It's from England. And it stars Anna Friel, uh, Michelle Williams, Oliver Milburn, and a brief uh, moment with Kyle MacLachlan. It was um, really wonderful. And uh, not quite as sad as I was expecting. I was expecting it to be a lot darker. Um, it's about a couple of girls who are neighbors and best friends, Holly and Marina. Um, Holly is a little less outgoing. That's Michelle Williams. And Marina is the more outgoing one. And her parents are um, a, a lot less traditional. And um, she has a brother named Matt. Um, and from forever, from what you're told, you can see from the film, um, the Michelle Williams character is super in love with her brother, with her friend's brother, um, which causes strife between the two of them throughout the film. But it's not really about him coming between them so much as a dangerous codependency that the girls have with each other. Um, one, where the one girl builds herself up by bringing the other girl down and the other girl holds herself back by listening to the to her one friend and it's it's a really sad um cycle that a lot of people get into I I can't speak for sorry my eye Ugh. Ah, okay I can't speak for dudes but I know that as a girl I definitely was in a friendship like this uh luckily our our friendship it was only really bad early in high school and then it it sort of became less toxic and very healthy as as we grew older but in this film um it just continues getting worse and worse and till the the end um Michelle Williams is such a good actress she's just like oof. she's got some of the most like emotive eyes I feel like that have ever been on the screen um and oh my god okay so two things one Kyle McLaughlin is like a real creep in this he in the the third part of the film when they're in university he plays the um professor that they're both stooping and he's such a creep he's such a creep and I'm like girls don't fall for this creep and they both fall for it um, and then two, the guy playing Nat, who I'm not actually sure if I've seen him in anything. It's Oliver Milburn. Is, like, super hot. And, like, for the bulk of the film, he's, like, late. It's, like, late 70s, early 80s. Sort of skinny punk rock kind of look. Like, at one point, he kind of looks like Sid Vicious. And at another point, he looks like Joe Strummer. And he's, like, super skinny. And he's got the hat and the little scarves and I'm just like yes yes Holly you made the right you made the right aesthetic choice in this dude um pretty much I was kept watching the movie going want <laughs> so that's good right that's that's what you want from a movie um oh young Marina who's the young version of Anna Friel's character is Anna Popwell from the Lion the Witch in the Wardrobe and I think the mom of them is, um, yeah, the mom is Trudy Styler, who is, uh, in my mind, best known as Sting's wife, who wears terrible dresses to the Oscars. That's all I remember her from. Um, oh, and uh, Wickham from the 1995 Pride and Prejudice shows up towards the end of this movie also. Uh, that actor's name is Adrian Lucas, but he will forever be for most of us Wickham. <sighs> Nobody likes Wickham. Uh, so, yeah, it was, the parts with the friendship, it was sort of hard to watch because it was such a terrible friendship. And you're like, girls, can you not tell that you should not be friends? Like, just stop being friends. This is terrible. And then, but then the, like, sort of star-crossed lovers love story between the Michelle Williams, Oliver Milburn character was just, like, the right kind of, of tension that you're just like, just get together already, damn it. Um, 
it's one of those movies where you just yell at the screen like, stop what you're doing and just get together already, <laughs> god damn it. Um, that kept the movie going, you know. Uh, I watched this on Stars. Uh, I'm not going to complain about the Stars player, even though I hate that player. Oops, there I am complaining. Um, so you can watch it on Stars Play. Again, it's from 2001, and it's Sandra Goldblocker's Goldbacher's, uh, Me Without You, starring Michelle Williams and Anna Friel. And I quite liked it. <laughs>